it's not here. Dang it's it. Here. No, it's here. What? A little camper power. Here we go. What's in the box? Well, it's here. Let's take a look. Let's see what we got. You know what this is, hon? Uh, I don't you know. don't see all. You don't see. Uh, you don't see a lot of new stuff from Yeti. You know we've bought a lot of Yeti stuff over the years, but you don't see a lot of new stuff. You see different colors, different changes. You see a lot of expensive stuff from Yeti, but this one probably tops it all. So everybody's been kind of a little hype about this product, which is the brand new Yeti cast iron pan, cast iron cookware from Yeti, four hundred dollars after tax like 420 something 425 after tax this is a 400 dollar cast iron pan now would you spend 400 dollars for a cast iron pan i don't know but we're gonna open someone it up. did well yeah people do they sold out these pans are actually made in pennsylvania i think shipped out of maryland designed in virginia whatever the case may be there's another company that's in pennsylvania that makes a killer cast iron pan and we're going to talk about them for frying pan Friday, which is right after this is expensive Thursday. So let's take a look at this right now. Of course you got the Yeti wow. branding. You're paying for the name. You are paying for the name and the rebranding. This is the, uh, I'll give you a nice cotton bag yeah. to store your cast iron pan in. What does it say? It says built for the wild Yeti. So those are probably come with the butter pad industries one as well. So it's kind of like a collaboration, I would call it. Built for the wild Yeti. Use this card as a scraper. So this would be the scraper cleaning ring. Tool. Yeah, cleaning tool. You get a couple Yeti Ooh. frying pan stickers. And a built for the wild poster. Post poster, yeah. Good for raising the stakes pop this open here but did it can i see the front again yeah sure oh cowboy cornbread okay so then you have uh the yeti the ring rag mustard crud not your seasoning so this will keep so the is that on like these. chain mail yeah chain mail yeah these pans, pans are seasoned seasoned i guess you would call it so you have that and then we get to the pan we're probably one of the first people to have one of these. Let's take a look at it. So this is a 12 inch. Hopefully you can see that there. Mm -hmm. Just a little wipe off, a little bit of dust on it. They're custom branded Yeti. So that's probably the extra cost there. But they're custom branded for Yeti. Although these would probably say like Butter Pad Industries or something like that on, on them. A little bit of a smaller handle. It's light. It's thin. It's really light. It's one thing I noticed about it. I mean, it's built well. The bottom's heavy, but the walls are thin. So when you get, like, your lodges and everything else, they're, they're a lot thicker because they're mass-produced. These are, like, handcrafted, I guess they would call it. you got the pour spout on both sides. Give you a little... They, you, I'm going to have to have you feel this because... No, no branding, straight flat bottom. No branding on the bottom. The bottom almost doesn't look the same though. It is smooth, USA made. Of course, you see the indents here. I mean, that's a really small, light handle. So the pan is kind of top heavy. Now you don't want huge handles, but at the same time, I do like a handle that you can like handle. You flip something and yeah, exactly handle it. So that's what you get in the box. That's it. We'll save the box for life. No warranty? No uh, Yeti code? You can't register it? I don't know. Probably probably not. Do you think it's an heirloom piece that you'll pass it down? It's a, I think, I think generations? you could. I, I cast iron, almost any cast iron you're going to keep for probably a lifetime as long as you take care of it. It looks like it's like a little bit, the seasoning on it's like a little off, like a brown. Some will turn like, it'll probably turn darker when we heat it up. But it's definitely seasoned, definitely lightweight. I can't wait till later this week when we get 
So we have we have another we have another item to talk to talk to you about. So one thing I'm going to do is probably give something away on the channel because it's just our style. It's Father's Day coming up. There's some cool stuff going on. So I'd like to do something uh, probably in the uh, next future, a couple videos. We're going to do some kind of a giveaway that deals with cast iron. And I know what I'm going to do. But anyway, this is the Yeti 12 inch cast iron made by Butterpat Industries in a collaboration with them. Just released. If you have any questions on it, I'll do my best. We'll get some close up shots for you to check it out just right outside of the box. That's it. It'll be fun. I mean, a good amount of space, though. I mean, 12 inch pan, I, I prefer a 12 inch pan. Like the 10 inch ones, the smaller ones are nice. 10 and a half, 12, you can get bigger. Once you get, you know, you can get two nice steaks in here, get some eggs in there, potatoes, whatever you want to do. It, it's definitely a smooth, what you're paying for is the machine. And actually, these are probably hand done, but uh, the, the, the smooth finish. So if you ever buy like a cheaper cast iron pan, there's a big difference between like your everyday eight and ten dollar ones, and they take a lot longer to season, a lot longer to they're harder to maintain, harder to clean. I don't know if it's four hundred dollars. I don't know if it's four hundred dollars. This is no like bash to Yeti. People know that yet you're paying for a name and, and a brand and everything else. But if you want to save yourself, you can get basically this exact same pan from Butter, Butter Pat Industries directly, and probably save yourself fifty or sixty bucks. And you could save even more and get a really good quality pan uh, in the one fifty two hundred dollar range that are, are pretty much considered your top pans. This is this is highly highly uh, expect like it wasn't expected, but it's what's the word I'm looking for? We're anticipating. There was like a, an anticipation there when they announced this. They wanted to get out for Father's Day. They did the first run; it sold out. What can you say? There are people that have the money to to buy a pan or give it as a gift that will pay the few extra dollars for the Yeti branding and everything else. So that's it. Or they'll finance it. Or they can finance it. Or Six could, easy payments. Or they could do what we did. Give your firstborn. I won't talk about it right now. <laughs> will you buy it? Will you not? Let me know in the comments what your thoughts are on it. And then we will follow back with you with another video on frying pan friday where we're going to talk about another product that i think you guys will have some interest in and this one here will we'll be back with it in future videos we'll see you in the next pixel